Alternator Man here. What we have is the 8 volt positive ground 10SI series alternator. This is an 8 volt setup positive ground which means that you put your negative battery post here then your positive is going to go to the base. It's just exactly opposite of a negative ground setup where with negative ground you typically would put the battery post here, the positive post and then the negative goes to here. But now with the positive ground to excite these alternators and the only reason you'd have to excite is sometimes if they sit around for a while they'll lose their magnetism. These are self-exciting so they work off residual magnetism and sometimes they'll lose that magnetism so they'll have to excite it. So with this 8 volt positive ground to excite this alternator you're going to run a jumper, just a momentary jumper from the case of the alternator and touch it right on the number one terminal right here. If you hit the number two terminal, it's not going to hurt anything. So to excite these alternators, once you get your negative on here and your positive on the base, you run a jumper from the case of the alternator, which is positive power, to this number one terminal just momentarily with it running, and it'll take off and go. Now this one in particular has our A203 pulley. This is the 5 8 and 3 quarter wide. These alternators standard come with the 3 8 wide automotive belt, but you can order them with the A202 pulley, which is a half inch wide V-belt, or the A203 pulley, which is the 3 quarter inch, uh, 5 8 and 3 quarter wide V-belt. This one's going on an old, uh, I believe a Dodge or something like that, that has the wider belt on it. This is the 8 volt uh, alternator. Uh, based on the GM 10SI series alternator, all brand new top quality. Uh, down in the description below there's going to be a link to both the A202 pulley, the A203 pulley, and the two different 8 volt alternators. There's going to be a link in the description, so check it out. 